Good evening. Cesar Quintana is fearful for his son's life, and he just got back from Washington, D.C. to meet with lawmakers to see what he can do. This was on Father's Day 2020. He had just turned a year. Cesar Quintana reminisces on memories with his two year old son, Alexander, looking back at photos and videos. <laughs> Quintana has full custody of Alexander, but says Alexander was abducted and taken to Ukraine by his estranged wife in December 2020, following a supervised visit. Quintana has struggled to get his son back ever since. And then Russia invaded Ukraine, and Quintana hasn't heard about his son's whereabouts since March 2nd. I think the last time I knew he was in the city of Mariupol, which is the worst, that's gotten the worst of the, of the Russian invasion. Quintana just wants to know if his son is safe. Just to know that, frankly, that he's alive and not hurt. A thought that torments him. Really, I feel sad, almost depressed a lot of the time. Quintana says he met with lawmakers in D.C. about his options. And I see all these congressmen and senators talking about Ukraine and helping Ukraine and even talking about these children that were injured in Ukraine, these Ukrainian children, which I also empathize with. But what about an American child in Ukraine? That, you know, that they just maybe almost shrug their shoulders and say, well, you know, what can we do? But he's not giving up until his son is back home in the U.S. So I try to just focus on him and that, but I try to imagine that in a way he's waiting for me. And Quintana plans to go to Poland next week to try to find his son and bring him back to the United States. Reporting live this evening, I'm Coco McAvoy, Fox 11 News.